say that dreams don't really come true. Rocketing into the sky already 6,400 feet above sea level, this is Garden of the Gods in the heart of Colorado Springs. We arrived at first light to pull up to a prime parking spot in the Jeep Gladiator. I wanna scream from mountaintops and tell the world will be alright. The Garden of the Gods has been here for at least two or three hundred million years. How do they know that? Well, back in the 1880s, they found this dinosaur skull, and it was kind of misidentified until 2008. And it seems to be a unique species that only existed right here in this section of Colorado. moon, the sun, and the mountain. Pikes Peak, one of Colorado's 14ers, a precipice at least 14,000 feet high. And there are 58 of them in this state alone. You can drive to the Pikes Peak Summit or starting in 2021, the $100 million renovation of the Cog Railway will be complete. Just watch out for the storms when you're up top. They can be brutal, but the view is astonishing. I'm not giving up. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> the Broadmoor Soaring Adventure is a run of 10 zip lines suspended above the secluded South Cheyenne Canyon. The longest run on the zip line is 500 feet above the canyon floor. We will be going 45 miles an hour. It's not just zip lines, check this out. Back there in that ridge, there is Holly Gully. That's where there's a little bit of water seeping through the rocks. In the winter, it freezes and you can ice climb in there. Pick any season and Colorado Springs is an unforgettable vacation. And it's only about an hour 15 drive from Denver. Flying like a superhero is one more reason why it's amazing out there. I'm Dave Falcoff. The Weather Channel! Woo!